Did you know that according to the CDC, helmets reduce the risk of death by 37%? Wearing a helmet or riding a motorcycle should be required by law in every state because helmets save hundreds of lives each year. Helmets are a low cost item that should be required by law in every state due to the fact that they prevent serious injury and even death. To illustrate this, we will look at the risks involved with not wearing a helmet, the cost and availability of helmets, and the benefits of wearing a helmet. To begin, let's look at the risks involved when you don't wear a helmet. There are many risks involved with not wearing a helmet, but we're going to look at just three. First, according to an article from the lawyers at Meter Worth, riders without helmets are at a higher risk of suffering a traumatic burning injury if they were to get into a crash. If you were to be on a bike and get hit by a car, you can bet that you're going to fly off the bike and smack your head. If you decide not to wear a helmet, your injuries are going to be much more severe. A friend of mine was riding at night and lost control of his bike. He was not wearing a helmet. He walked away with many injuries, including a traumatic brain injury. His brain had massive swelling, and they had to put a drain in to drain out the excess fluid. Had he worn a helmet, his head injury would not have been as severe. In an article from the Journal of Neurosurgery Publishing Group, they stated that, according to National Highway Traffic Safety Administration estimates, wearing helmets saved the lives of 1,859 motorcycle riders in 2016, and an additional 802 lives could have been saved if every motorcyclist had worn a helmet. Wearing a helmet decreases the incidence and severity of traumatic brain injury crashes. My grandpa received a heart transplant from a man who passed away from a motorcycle accident. One of the nurses told my grandma, had the man worn a helmet, he would have lived. But I am thankful my grandpa received the transplant and we got to have him around a little longer. It's still heartbreaking that a man died and he could have lived had he just put on a helmet. Second, spinal injuries are more common for those who don't wear helmets. According to an article from the WorkSafe blog, helmets hold your head stationary. When your head is stationary, you are at less risk of neck or spinal injuries that can cause physical paralysis or even death. The third risk is damage to the face. Now while the first two injuries I mentioned are a lot more serious and more severe, road rash to the face would be extremely unpleasant. If you were to lay your bike down, and your face kiss the pavement, you can pretty much say goodbye to the skin on your face. Next, let's talk about the cost and availability of helmets. Helmets are extremely affordable and readily available to everyone. When looking into helmets, there are many options. However, a full face helmet will give you the most protection. According to the Harley Davidson website, full face helmets start around $135 and go up from there with different options available to meet specific needs when you compare that to the thousands of dollars in medical bills and the months of pain and rehab you would face if you were to get into an accident without a helmet, it's easy to see that a helmet is a good investment and worth the money. Next, helmets are extremely easy to get your hands on. Your local Harley dealer will have them in stock or you can order one online and have it shipped to you in just a few days. If you're not a big Harley fan, there are lots of other brands of great helmets as well. Let's look at some of the benefits of wearing a helmet. There are so many benefits of wearing a helmet. We are going to look at just three of them. First, according to an article in It Still Runs, wearing a helmet will protect its rider from weather. This can be the glare from the sun, the cold air if you're riding at night or in the fall, or even the rain. Mother nature isn't always nice. You can have a beautiful sunshiny day and in a split second it can turn to rain. If you have a helmet, you at least get to keep the rain out of your eyes. Second, Helmets keep flying objects from smacking you in the face. Without fail, if you're out on a ride, you're going to get pegged in the face with a big, fat, nasty bug. Or, if it's not a bug, it can be a rock. If you have a helmet, you at least have the chance to protect your eye and not get bug guts all over your face. Third, wearing a helmet will also help protect your eyes and ears from the wind. Not only can the wind be incredibly loud, it tends to sting your eyes and make them water, making it difficult to see. Like I said, these are just a few of the benefits of wearing a helmet when riding. To wrap things up, helmets are a low cost item that should be required by law for every state due to the fact that they can help prevent serious injury and even death.
To illustrate this, we looked at the risk of riding without a helmet, the cost and availability of helmets, and the benefits of wearing helmets. Next time you go to hike on your bike and go for a ride, keep in mind that helmets reduce the risk of head injury by 69%. Thanks.